So last time we talked, Alexis Keta, the founder of My Legacy Challenge, woohooed with two of her potential daddies, Ty Lum and Roy D. Dillon. Alexis was more than satisfied with Roy's woohoo techniques. She couldn't stop thinking about how good it was, even in her dreams. She woke up and went to work. Her day was going well until she haphazardly took a shady brand deal and ended up getting demonetized. Gurley was so embarrassed, but she felt better when Bjorn Björsson asked her to go with him to the Spice Festival. Townies started running for their lives the second they arrived. Sims are so funny sometimes. Alexis and Bjorn were eager to talk to each other and started flirting. She kept flirting and suddenly he started rejecting her. She let it slide and kept the conversation friendly. Wow this oregano is trash. Oh well Bjorn, didn't know you were chill like that. Alexis and Bjorn took some selfies. I wonder if Adam Levine and Sumner Stroh took similar pics. Alexis tried flirting again and Bjorn rejected her instantly. But then he started flirting with her. So she flirted back and then he rejected her again. Dude what the fuck is wrong with you? Why all of a sudden are you deciding to be loyal to your wife? Why is he the one that's hurt? Alexis got sick of his games, so she went home and listened to music while working on her entrepreneurial skill. Suddenly, her neighbor started banging on the door. Or, oh, he's big angry because of the music. Let me turn it up just for him. Ooh, shiver me timbers. Go ahead and remember it. Anyways, Alexis got that promotion she needed and also did some woohoo work, which made her 1300 simoleons and got her nominated for an award. She invited Ty over to celebrate. Out of all the wallets she was considering, she was leaning towards Ty, despite his job title. She figured, considering he's a descendant of the founding family of Copperdale, that he had to have some bank stashed somewhere. Not only that, but he was a gentleman and a romantic. A traditional man, you could say. Except in the bedroom. Oh, he was certainly more than traditional. Alexis decided to ask Ty to be her sugar daddy, and he happily agreed. He gave her his golden credit card, and my my, did she underestimate him. He told her to take as much as she wanted. You don't have to say it twice, old f After Ty left, Alexis heard music blaring from her neighbor's apartment. You think that phases me mother f Alexis woke up feeling uncomfortable. I checked her moodlets, and... What? Ain't no way. Ain't no way that old f gave her crab lice. You're telling me he gets p Oh no, now we got a problem. 